Hey, it's Steve. I, uh, I finally learned how to use my sewing machine uh, about a month ago. I took a class from Fabricate. It's a little, little school right across the road here that teaches you how to sew. So I went over there, I learned how to sew, and they showed me how to make this nice bag. So I thought I might flip this bag into maybe a product line uh, of handmade fabric creation. So I had to come up with some ideas, and I thought I'd share with you my uh, first pilot project for Imagine Wagon handmade fabric creations that are simple, practical, and they emphasize inner beauty. So here's the first uh, thing that I changed about this bag with my new bag is I went with a very durable uh, 600 by 600 polyester denier fabric for the exterior. So the outside of the bag, this is the exact same material that, that you'll see on, you know, commercial rucksacks or backpacks, anything like that. Uh, it's, again, it's very densely woven, and on the back, it's got a, a polyurethane uh, back coating. Uh, so it's, it's very, very durable. It's very, very water repellent, uh, and you can uh, throw anything you want inside your bag and not worry about uh, it getting ruined by the water. And then what I did is I bought all these half yard lots of very colorful fabrics. So that's the emphasis on inner beauty. So these bags will have this beautiful uh, foliage green uh, exterior that's very simple, very practical, very durable. I'll also make them in, uh, in a midnight uh, blue. I just don't have the order in yet, but I'm gonna have a midnight blue, exact same fabric, so there'll be two exterior colors, midnight blue and foliage green. And then each bag will have its own unique, colorful interior that's 100% cotton, um, and, uh, and again, so like here, I'm going to make this first lot, this first pilot lot is going to be three. So I'm going to make three bags and, uh, they're all going to be green because I made one cut on a green roll. And, uh, and then one's going to have this red flowery inside and one's going to have this, uh, red and white, uh, picnic checker bag board, uh, uh, pattern. And then one's going to have this cute little, uh, elephant pattern. Uh, that I got enough to make there's going to be one blue bag and one green bag with an elephant inside So I'm excited about that very excited about that because that's Elliot uh, is my grandson and he's he's the elephant baby So the handles are really important. I found the this really great one inch uh, It's a neutral color uh, Cotton It's very durable. I think it'll last for a long time and I made some changes to the way the stitching is done. And I think these are going to be really bomb-proof handles. You're going to be able to use them for a long, long time. And they're, they're not, they're not going, to, going to wear out very easily. And then the other thing that I'm doing to emphasize the uh, inner beauty is, uh, and simple design is I'm using uh, design buttons. So there's uh, two buttons that are going to be on every bag. So there's going to be a, the polyester exterior, the cotton interior. And then on the, uh, on the exterior, there's going to be a simple little, a little uh, a wooden um, button. I don't know if you can see that, but it says handmade with love on it. And maybe if I'm lucky, I can get uh, some buttons with an Imagine Wagon logo on them, and that's what that'll be. But it's just a simple button that'll be uh, against the green fabric on the outside. And then for on the inside, there's another little button. And I've got, I've got a wide variety of these. There's a bunch of designs, all different designs. So you'll have a unique inside pattern along with a unique inside button and that's that's kind of the that's kind of the design so again uh, I'm excited about it uh, I think it's going to take me a few days because uh, it's a brand it's the first uh, project I've ever done sewing wise on my own 
It's the first uh, sewing project that I've ever designed on my own. So I designed the bag. I took a, a base design, but I made wild changes to it. And there's things that I don't, I really don't know how to do yet. And I'm going to have to figure them out. So I think it's going to take me a while to do this first uh, group of three. And then I'm going to do another group of three uh, in uh, Midnight Blue. Uh, and then I'll do a production run and, and we'll call it, we'll call it done. So anyway... Uh, I'm excited about it. They're my new handmade fabric creations that are simple, practical, and emphasize inner beauty.